Hello, people. I am Jabby Kuwait, joined, joined by Achara Kirk. Hi, guys. And we're looking at Tada! Wow, I like, was not expecting that. Like Tada. Yeah. Tada. Or Tada. Tada. Wrong, wrong, wrong company. Different company. Yep. Tada. This is the official trailer starring Ahan Shetty and Tara Sutaria. It's produced by Sajid Nadirwala and directed by Milan Luthria. And it's written by Rajat Arora. This comes out December 3rd, which is in about a little over a month. So mark your calendars. Also, if you haven't already, please subscribe, hit that bell icon, all notifications, and vote this up to let YouTube know you're enjoying what you're watching. Here we go. Ishana, tell me something about you now. Yeah, tell me. Oh, shit. Oh, God, that looks painful. I know it's a prop, but the sound effect. Yeah. Oh, this music's nice. It's got a very dry feel. Yeah. Oh, dang. Oh, no. Oh, I thought something was gonna blow up there. Well, hey there, hey. What is that, like a rave? It's like Drive meets Kabir Singh, huh? Oh yeah, totally. <laughs> It's really pretty. Oh! Oh, wow. Okay, this is sexy. Daddy, <laughs> Oh, wow. Okay. Oh, dang. What the heck? What the heck? Ah, uh, man. And he does yoga on a motorcycle. Oh my god! <laughs> wow. Oh dang! Oh oh no! Oh no! He's a badass and, and he's spiritual. <laughs> Oh shit. Wow, this is crazy. All right. Oh wow. Oh. Dang. Oh. Oh no. Does she die? Oh no. Who's doing that? Why is he doing that? What the hell? Well, she did. Wait. There's some kind of part that was just like out of the uh, Leonardo DiCaprio film. Which one? He, the one where he's locked up in the insane asylum or something like that. Oh, Shutter Island? Shutter Island, yeah. He's trying to hug his dead wife and then like it goes through like Ash. Oh, I don't, yeah. Cause she, get, Cause she did. She did. Yeah. So she did. Yeah. Well, I mean, it looked like it was pulled straight out of that movie, right? <laughs> but um, I liked the music at the very beginning. It had a very drive feel to yeah, it. Yeah, that and, was really cool. The, the, and so the, it, gave the, me, yeah. it gave me that sense about it. But then with the drinking and the motorcycle and the obsession, it had a very Kabir Singh element to it as well. Mm -hmm. And then he does yoga on top of the motorcycle. I'm like, what the hell? Who is this guy? Blowing my mind. It's like, the, he's a badass and he's spiritual. I'm like, Whoa. No, because the woman tamed the beast. She calmed she down the anger. <laughs> and then he got angry again. She, she didn't tame that beast. Yeah, she did. He's, he was all like, I fight for love now. I'm all about my love. And then and then they were all like, oh, you've only met her twice and you're already thinking about marrying her? Like, whoa, what's going on, you know? It's clearly a, a tale of obsession. It's I, a tale of love I, that turns into obsession. It's a tale of obsession. 
If you want to call it love, that's subjective. Well, that's what the trailer's telling me. The trailer's telling me that this is a love story. No, but what the I'm trailer's a telling you is that something is wrong with this guy. He needs to get his, he needs a CAT scan. So <laughs> in, the, in the lyrics, it, he sa it says, uh, I've loved you more than I love myself. That's always a sign of issues and toxicity. That is a red so flag, you, people. You be careful there. Yeah, if um, someone tells you that they love you more than they love themselves, you, GTFO, that is not a good sign. Yeah. You should love yourself. And when you love yourself, you yeah. can love everyone else. And if you are saying that to somebody, you need a CAT scan. Yes. So uh, I am very, very glad I'm not dating Tara Sutario because there's Why? a lot of crotch on crotch in this and I would be mad jealous. <laughs> <laughs> like, God damn. That's what you're thinking? Do you have any idea how many times they were like right on top of each other? I'm like, yeah, I, know I know it's acting, but goddamn, like <laughs> really good acting. It was very sexy. I'll yeah. give it that. Yeah. yeah. It was like, oh boy. I mean, this, this. And he's like, he's like the Indian Incredible Hulk over here with the rage issues. Yeah. I'm like, so not only am I jealous, but I'm afraid. I can't do anything about this. <laughs> yeah. You're like, oh, uh, stop touching my boo. Actually, please don't get mad at me. Yeah. Yeah. No, I mean. I thought that the action stuff was looking pretty cool. I'm gonna come at him with a, a painter's pole, just like the Mexican guy outside. <laughs> Can you tell the story, Javi? No so cares. that people have context. So I heard two Mexican guys outside my window screaming at each other. One was, well, it was one being more aggressive than the other <laughs> at, by the time I started looking and, and curtain twitching. <laughs> it was really <laughs> funny because Javi was in the office. I came in and all I see was like the rest of his body stuck outside and then his head was just like enveloped by the curtain. Right. He's just like. And I'm like, oh shit, something's about to go down. And so the painter, the who's the painter for this building, who's a real asshole. He is. Like I know he started something, but then he's regretted it because the other guy started getting in his face. And at some point the painter just like panicked and he went whack and he started, <laughs> he started whacking the guy in the head and started chasing him down the alley. That's what I would do to a Hanchetti if to Tara Sutari was my girlfriend. I'd be like, all right, once this movie's wrapped, I'm coming at you with a painter. <laughs> <laughs> Paul, <laughs> take that you know, for touching my bay. You know, How dare you? You know, yeah. I, 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 am I explaining it correctly? It's like one of those extension poles, so you can reach up high. So when you you're can painting. paint the ceiling yeah, with so a roller. Yeah. yeah, that's what I'm coming at him with. I'm yeah, gonna yeah, buy yeah. A, a, I'm gonna buy a pole just to come at him. <laughs> <laughs> Outside of all the you know stuff that we're mentioning, it, it has a very beautiful look, a, be, a very beautiful aesthetic to the whole thing. It really does. Yeah, it's got me curious at the very least, and some of the action in there look pretty cool. I don't know if it's gonna be hyperkinetic editing, which I am not a fan of. I mean, there are a few exceptions, but generally speaking, I don't like that. I prefer to be able to see the action and like I see that the actors have rehearsed this stuff and they have trained in order to, to execute this action as effectively as possible. Mm -hmm. When it's chopped up too much, I, I don't have fun with it. It just feels like I'm having a seizure or something. But it seems like there is a, a huge emphasis placed on him being this badass dude yeah. who, uh, you know, he's fisticuffs. <laughs> Yeah, he's going around beating people up, and then she's all like, "No, I want to know you. Yeah, I want to be with you." And then he's like, "Cool." Let's all do I can that say then. to the ladies who like get enamored with this type of dude, just you, don't, I'm, don't be surprised. Don't be surprised when he's like toxic and aggro and just too much. It's like if I have a daughter or a sister, I do have a sister. If there is a guy like this in proximity, I'm, I'm gonna be like, "Look, I get why." you were attracted to that. Like, Look at the a, hair, look at the beard, there's look a at raw, the muscles. There's a raw magnetism there. Yep. But that's some bad news, I'm telling you. That's bad news, he might, bears. He might pin you up against the wall and choke that you. That was her, right, at the end? If it wasn't her, it looked a lot like her. Yeah, that. I mean, that's disturbing to me because it's like, what? Maybe she did something What did she feelings. do? What did she do? Like, he's there all beat up. And I mean, I do not condone. Maybe she taught him bad yoga. <sighs> She was, she was teaching him. No one gets that angry about bad I would yoga. if you taught me the moose moose pose, and that's not a thing. The, mo <laughs> what? the moose moose pose? Yeah, that's not a pose, right? I, I just made that up. But if you no, taught me something. I think something, you mean the moose knuckle. That's a thing? No. Oh, okay. But if you taught me some pose, and I'm like, you know, out there saying, I know the moose moose pose, I mastered that shit, and that's not a real thing, I'd be mad enough to put you up against the wall with my. <laughs> This is too much. Okay. No, I mean, no, but I don't condone that behavior. I like, no matter what she did. <laughs> you don't, you don't like to get choked out by your man. Every no. Every once in a while, it's kind of nice. No. Stand up against the wall. No. No <laughs> like one. Like he's no. got the strength of a vampire. I know. He's lifting her up like a foot off the floor, and she's looking. I mean, she's looking worried, but she's not looking as concerned as she kind of should into be. It, maybe. <laughs> like it's just the beginning. 
Dang. Um, he looked all mangled too. So yeah, you know, that's why I'm like, did did she lie to him about something? And he had to go through all this stuff to make it through to the end, only to find out that she's still alive. And he's like, you're alive. Let me kill you. Cause I thought you were dead. I don't think it was that. No. I think it was the moose moose pose. <laughs> <laughs> no, but it looks interesting. I'm definitely intrigued. I'm looking forward to either another trailer or the film itself. I mean, I, I'm definitely curious. The, the style is definitely interesting. I think I'm honestly more into the fighting action-y stuff than the, the romance stuff it's to masala. me. Masala. It is, it's everything. super masala. That's, that's the thing. This feels very masala to me. You know, it's like ladies or romance fans here, you know, here is the romance, here's the love, here's the beautiful this costumes guy and all that. This guy directed Once Upon a Time in Mumbai and Once Upon a Time uh, Once Upon a Time in Mumbai, Dabara. Oh. Uh, as well as The Dirty Picture, Chori Chori, Kache Dage, and Bad Ho. He's done a lot of stuff, and ta-da! Okay. Ta-da! So, you guys, okay. thanks so much for hanging out. Hopefully you enjoyed that. Let us know your feelings in the comments below, what you liked, what you didn't like, why. And uh, subscribe if you haven't already hit that bell icon, all notifications. Vote this up, please. I'm Jabby Koi. This is... Achara Kirk. Peace out.